guys, it's Sam. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am actually in Chad's dorm and I needed to film. It is 6.30 in the morning right now and let me tell you guys the importance of this day. Today is September 15th. I'm probably going to post this on the same day. The new iPhone gets released today and I could not be more excited. I literally woke up at 6 a.m. in order to be able to do this. So Eastern time, it gets released at 8 a.m. but there's some things I need to do like go home first. So let's go home and I'm going to explain everything that we need to do to pre-order the new iPhone 15. It is actually so crazy that I'm even up right now and have this much energy. I have work in three hours, so I needed to get up early, but I'm so tired. I feel very dizzy, which is a whole other story, but I need to go home and get everything situated before the iPhone actually gets released so I can get what I want. So I figured since you guys love all my vlogs about iPhones and customizations that I would bring you guys along the process. As you guys can see, it's 6.39 in the morning on Friday the 15th, and this is currently the iPhone 14 Pro in deep purple, but I will tell you guys exactly why I'm changing it when I get to my house. Have to just clean up Chad's room really quick and then we're gonna go. I decided that I need to go to Starbucks because I just don't feel good at all. So we're going to go to Starbucks and get a little pick me up strawberry acai and hopefully it gets me in the right spirit and energy to order this phone and have a good day. I just got my Starbucks. Let me tell you guys, this is doing what I needed it to do. All right, so we are going to get into this video. We are going to talk about the iPhone, the differences, why I chose the phone I'm getting, and why I'm even filming this to begin with. First things first, I do wanna give credit to Samantha Nicole for this video. I watched her video, I think it was about the iPhone 13 Pro, I wanna say, a while ago, like a few years ago, and ever since she made that video, it really just inspired me to vlog everything. I love Samantha Nicole. She's one of my favorite YouTubers. I will have her channel linked down below. I watch her all the time. She's my comfort YouTuber. And she really taught me that I shouldn't be scared to vlog what I want to vlog. And she made a video about pre-ordering her phone. And in that video, she was addressing why she was filming that video. And I just really understood why she was explaining why she was filming it. And ever since then, I was like, you know what? She just taught me that I should really film whatever I want. And ever since then, I was like, all right, you know what? Just film everything. And I am going to admit, it has taken me a while to just be able to film everything that I want to film. However, we're here now and I wanted to give her credit for this because I did get this idea from her and I also love her I literally watch her all the time so definitely go check her channel out with that being said I also wanted to say that I am NOT a tech channel I don't really know all the specs and details about the phone I'm just kind of like breaking it down from someone who has no idea what they're really talking about but still did their research and knows what I'm saying I just can't go into detail if that makes sense so with all that being said right now it is 7 30 so the iPhone comes out in 30 minutes and it is getting down to the wire so so first, I think we should talk about the differences between the two phones. And I took notes, you guys. I watched the Apple event, I watched YouTube videos, I watched so many different things and did so much research to figure out what is the difference between the 15 and the 15 Pro. For me personally, since I do content creation, I really wanted a phone that would allow me to do my best work. And that is why I chose the phone that I did, but we'll get into that a little later. So I have to do this really fast because the phone is literally dropping so soon, but let's go over this before the pre-order. First thing is the obvious difference is the price. So the iPhone 15 and the iPhone 15 Pro are two different prices, as well as the iPhone 15 Plus and the iPhone 15 Max Pro. I feel like I'm talking like so fast and like it's a whirlwind to say. I am only going to compare the 15 and the 15 Pro just for the purpose of time in this video because I don't want to make it too long. But the 15 starts at $799 and the 15 Pro starts at $999. This is before you choose how much storage you want on your phone. So if you choose 128, it'll be closer to the $799 for the 15 and the $999 for the 15 Pro. And then if you choose the 256, which I personally always get, which is more storage, then obviously the price will be a little higher. That was the first thing I saw. The second thing I saw that was actually the same is the screen size. So the 15 and the 15 Pro, not the max, the regular, are 6.1 inches for the size. So that's kind of like the same. The 15 has color infused glass and the 15 Pro has titanium on the backing with the texture glass so it's a little different for the back of the phone. The 15 has a 16 chip and the 15 Pro has a 17 chip. I don't really know what that means but that is a difference between the two. If you know what that means please let me know. The 15 has a ring silent switch and the 15 Pro has an action button and then the main difference for me was the cameras. As we know the 13, the 14, the 15, not the Pros all had two cameras whereas the Pros for the 13, the 14, and the 15 had three cameras. Personally I always went with the Pros because of the camera and 
and I am leaning more towards that but I'm also kind of in the middle so hold on but like I said the 15 has two cameras and the 15 Pro has three cameras and with that in mind they both have the main and ultra wide cameras but the 15 Pro has the telephoto in the camera as well those are the main differences that I thought were worth mentioning in a video that isn't supposed to be too techy because I really have no idea what I'm talking about other than the cameras because that is something that I show a lot of interest in but with that being said the next difference are the colors I don't know why but for some reason the 15 and the 15 Pro do not come in the same colors the 15 are more pastel colors and then the 15 Pro are titanium colors so we're gonna go through them because when I saw this I was like this is what's going to make or break it for me so as we know the 15 like I said is pastel colors it comes in pink green yellow blue and black I'll have a little photo on the screen right here so you guys can see I was obsessed and still am with the pink when I saw this I was like oh my gosh I literally might do the 15 because I want the pink phone but then logically thinking about it I was like okay but I want a higher quality camera and I asked on my Instagram story which if you don't follow me go follow me because I do a lot of polls like this I'll have it linked down below but it's also right here but anyway I asked on the story and everyone was like get the pink phone and I was like oh my gosh should I get the pink phone so then I called my mom I asked so many people and I was getting so many different answers and at the end of the day I was like okay I need something that is going to make my photos the best that they can be and I thought that that was gonna be the 15 Pro so I was leaning more towards that now we're gonna talk about the 15 Pro colors which I will also have right here but basically they are titanium colors and I'm not exactly sure why but they're completely different colors than the 15 and they're not pastel so there's titanium black titanium white titanium blue and titanium neutral I really really liked the neutral one so right now I'm between the pink and the neutral when I was doing these comparisons I really couldn't find any other differences that would matter to me other than the camera when I was asking myself I was like okay I'm not really gonna use telephoto I don't even know what that is or if I'm pronouncing it wrong I'll have what it is right here but I like really didn't know what to do so I'm kind of still in the middle but I think think I am going to do the titanium neutral iPhone 15 Pro so let's get ready for pre-order there is officially 10 minutes until it drops I forgot to tell you guys that last night I actually went on Apple to kind of look at the phones and just do more research and everything and I realized that they had the option to get your pre-order ready so right now my cart looks like this I'll have a little picture up on the screen I did put the natural titanium in my cart last night the iPhone 15 Pro because I thought that's what I was going to do and I was just gonna switch it in the morning if I changed my mind but I am going to go with the pro just because like I said I think it is the most beneficial phone for me for taking photos and for what I do which is content creation I really just want the best phone so I could put the best quality content out for you guys even though I do film on my camera I take all my pictures on my phone so I just thought that that was the best thing to do I have a five minute countdown on my computer going on I get so stressed out when countdowns are going on because I want to make sure I get it my goal is to get to the pickup location which is going to be the mall for me at 8 a.m. which is when they open on next Friday, which is September 22nd, because that's when it drops. So I'm so excited, that's what we're gonna try to do, and I'll keep you updated to see if it actually happens, because I'm getting stressed out. There is officially like a minute to like 45 seconds until the phone actually comes out, and I'm not even by my computer yet. But don't worry, I have it up, I just had to do something. Okay, I'm going now. You guys, I got the phone. I am so excited. Let me tell you though, that was so stressful. I went onto the website, as I told you guys, 10 minutes early. It was being a little weird, but I had the website and the app open because like I told you guys, I had my pre-order ready, so I just had to check out. And that worked, but it took so long because I think so many people were trying to pre-order the phone on the app and the website. I had both things open. I had both the app and the website open, logged into my account, and I just couldn't get it to work. Thankfully, it eventually worked but it did take some time and it was so stressful that I couldn't even film it because like I said I needed to get the phone at a certain time from the mall because I'm going to the city and I won't be here to get it and I wanted to pick it up because number one my phone is broken I forgot to tell you guys like what happened to my phone but it works but it doesn't work for what I needed to do so I need to just get a new phone and also my plan is up I have the plan that when Apple comes out with a new phone I can trade this phone in for a new one and it'll be okay because it's not broken and 
that sense. It just is too slow and does not do what I need it to do. So I needed to trade this one in and I wanted to get the phone as soon as possible. And I also wanted to do an unboxing the soonest I can for you guys. And I always like to pick up the phone right when they come out so I can get the video up as soon as possible. And since I'm going to the city, I needed the earliest time. And when I was clicking it, I was like, oh my gosh, it's not working. Like, I don't know what to do. Thankfully, I finally got it to work and it is okay. And I did get it, but that was so stressful. But definitely stay tuned for that unboxing video because I promise you guys are not going to want to miss it. I have a whole new iOS 17 customization idea coming. So stay tuned for that as well. And iOS 17, I think it's released to the public on the 18th of September. So stay tuned for that. I have a video already up about how to customize your phone. So definitely go check that out. If you guys liked this little vlog, be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for my other iPhone videos coming soon. Thank you guys for watching. If you stayed up until this point in the video, comment if you're getting the new phone and if you are, what phone you decided to get. And with that being said, I'll see you really soon in my next video. Bye.